Um, John Mothersoul, the returning officer for Sheffield, and myself, Lee Adams, deputy returning officer, are apologising tonight um, for the fact that um, several people were not allowed, able to vote. Um, unfortunately, we got it wrong and we'd very much like to apologise to everybody who found themselves in this situation. We were faced with a very difficult position with the numbers of people turning up, which were, seems to be unprecedented. A large amount of students also turning up to vote without polling cards, and it just took a lot longer to process them, process them in that situation so that um, we could make sure that uh, they were given the correct ballot papers. So the only remedy we could take, um, unfortunately, because um, we couldn't extend the voting time because we have to close at 10 um, uh, and that was not open to us, I'm afraid. So, so that's the legal requirement that it has to be 10 Yes, and we, uh, we doubly checked that, and um, we had to close the doors at 10 and not take any votes. Okay. And uh, you said you were down there yourself. Could you uh, describe yes. you know, what, what the situation I was at one particular polling station, and I went there immediately. I heard there was a problem. Um, there were long queues outside. I would estimate about 200 people queuing a mixture of students and residents, uh, but a large majority of students, I would say. And um, we just, pro the staff were doing all they could. I made sure they were doing all they could to get as many people through by 10 as possible, but the numbers just overwhelmed us. Clearly, um, this is an extremely unfortunate situation and we're most sorry that it's occurred. So the boxes from there have arrived now? And the, the boxes um, were brought into the count as soon as possible and um, that's fine up until that point. Unfortunately, a number of people, um, approximately 200 I'd say, were not able to vote.